match. A lot of fast moving tag teams in this. Absolutely, a lot of moving parts. I mean, we got a lot of different abilities and uh, unique qualities that each team brings. I mean, we're gonna have a mix and match of different styles here. Well, I thought originally, uh, you know, who this might as well rip up the format sheet at this point. Yeah. It seems that the two teams have decided that this is going to be a one, two, three, four, five, six, eight man tag match. Is that what they just, that's, I, that's I, what I I'm see. seeing here? This I know. promoter really needs to get in charge of Jeepers, his, his well, I don't know what's going on anymore. People here, just show wait, up. Wait, wait, wait. Chael Connors has a vest on. Oh, wait a second. Oh, the vest in the world being joined yeah, by Yeah, all right. The they both got vests. I mean, TJ's is a little dumb, but the, the Chael Connors looks good. Matches his colors. Nice. Well, I, want, I don't feel nice. like you should talk about our, our birthday boy like that, but hey, that Creed music he, made he me a little bit day, sick. I'll be right back. day over 62. Well, I guess you could say that CXR, or, uh, the Even Steam is making an investment on CXR. Yeah, you could, Mike. You could. You, you could. could. I had to get that one in a little bit. So, eight-man tag. Tell me, Michael Robertson. Yeah, yes. What is the goal of an eight-man tag? Do you, do you try to take one opponent and try to wear that person down? Because you've got three more just you know, needing a tag. It's got to be similar to, oh, look at this. Who we got in commentary uh, just briefly here? Anthony Gango, Dr. Sleep. Hello. Welcome. Hello. How is everyone? Big win today, Anthony Gangon. You look stylish. Thank you so you, much. You were very good to the fans out there. You didn't even break a sweat, and it's 100 degrees. You're wearing long sleeves. That is because how cool you really are. Thank you. Thank you. And the, and the sun was shining on me so bright with this white, and uh, I really appreciate it, guys. And I got to tell you, it was cloudy. There was dark clouds, but you came out. The clouds parted. The sun shone down on the audience. It really, it really warmed my heart. Thank and, you. And Thank look at this you. takedown by Cheech over here. I know we got Anthony Gangone at ringside, but, you know, eight-man tag right here, Anthony Gangone. Uh, what do you think, what would it take for a team to win? What's the strategy? Yeah, this match is a lot similar to the match I just have. You have to have eyes in the back of your head. There's many, many talents in there. Everyone in there, very talented. But uh, in this kind of match, you just got to have a little bit of luck and a little bit of strategy and have your eyes in the back of your head too. And look at this, the counter here by Cheech and he had the eyes in the back of his head taking down Shell Connors. Now, Anthony Gangon, as my longtime personal friend, now I won't forget that you did try to close Excite Wrestling at one time. There was a time where you tried to close us. You didn't succeed, which I'm happy for because we became great friends, yes. great friends. Absolutely. And. Quite frankly, you know, I've known you a very long time. It seems like you just get better and smarter every time you wrestle. Yeah, yeah, and that's what happens when you pay attention and you have a brain. You and I, we have a brain. I'm not sure about this person right here, but he looks very uh, nice. I do. I, I do. I'm nice. I do like your hair. You have glasses. That, that Thank help, you. That I appreciate you it. That helps you out. It makes him look smarter than he is, but that's okay. He's still pretty smart. Yeah. Well, you know, my memory might be that great, but I got reflexes at least. But speaking of reflexes, Colin Delaney has got a hold of TJ Epics. This is an eight-man tag match here at Excite Wrestling. we got a lot coming up here. And it's Colin Delaney. Oh, TJ Epics with the clothesline miss. Chop right there by Colin Delaney. Now, sure. as Dr. Sleep, Anthony Gangone, yes. there is eight competitors here, each one of them probably deserving of being put to sleep. Who would be the first one you would go after? Hmm. Uh, you know, I think I might go after the Stevens. I saw some bags underneath their eyes, so I do think they need to uh, get some rest. And I am the perfect guy to do that because I am, of course, a doctor in sleep. Very accommodating. Yes. Very understanding yes. of your opponent. Yes. Sometimes people have needs. I talked to Mike Skyros yesterday. I said, sometimes your body just tells you what you need. Yes. He needed extra sleep. I thought that maybe you guys were together mm. and that's why you weren't here yesterday. Mm. But I would have totally understood that because that's very giving of you. And look at these shots by Colin Delaney and TJ Apex getting almost seesawed out of the ring there. Mike's, yeah, Mike tends to interrupt us talking about other things than the match. I, I got to keep it grounded here. No, no, he, and you're absolutely right. And thank you for doing that. We do have to talk about this match as well. Uh, just one last thing. You don't think Kate 
would be upset by me taking her headset, right? I don't know. I think she's more. I, I thought. Where did Kate go? Where'd you put Kate I, exactly? No, 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 no. I saw her walk away. Uh, she asked me to come here, uh, and I thought I'd fill in. Well, I gotta tell you, she was a very big fan of yours. She didn't think you and I are very creepy at all. No, yeah. And uh, I, I totally understand why she would she would want you to fill in her spot while she wasn't here. Well, I think we're two very misunderstood people. But once you get to know us, you would realize that we're actually very, very nice and very giving. And, very giving. And we and we're great friends. It, That's true. That is true. Uh, I I believe she said. Two birds that flock together, you and I. Yes. It makes sense. Yes. And speaking of making sense here, look at Corey Jackson has a hold of Steven. I mean, you can't go wrong. Both of them are Steven. Can't tell which one's which sometimes. And now Ting on the top rope. Look at this double team move right here by Black and Yellow. Cover here, two, and that kick out at two. See, I feel like that might have been a mistake. If you have him up over your head, he's upside down. Now, as a master of sleep, mm -hmm. that actually could probably make you go unconscious if you kept in that position. I, I believe that to be true. All the blood rushes to your head, and then to fall from that distance, especially with a little bit of a push, it's a, uh, oh, uh, I think uh, I think Kate uh, wants her job back. I, I think she's she, she's trying to be very cautious. I mean, I, I maybe it mu maybe muddy on the path there. She's walking over. I, I did wave at her during my match. I don't know if she knows. I, I, I pointed that out to yes. her. I thought that yes. was very kind of you. Yeah, thank you. I thought that was very kind of you. Thank you, guys. And what's not very kind is Ting is going head first into the turnbuckle. So, oh, uh, see, she's so nice. Yeah. She realizes she brought me a water Let's that go. I might pass out just from heat stroke. I appreciate you guys. I will give her her job back. So Mr. Gangon, it is Mr. always Gangon. a pleasure. So Dr. Gangon, I'm, I'm sorry. Dr. Gangon, that's true. Thank you, thank you. And now Dr. Sleep is uh, making his way out of the commentary table. Kate has returned. I was a little concerned about your disappearance for a second. Well, the Creed music made me head to puke, so I ran to the bathroom real quick, and then I tried to come back to commentary, but Go was in my seat, and I wasn't in a rush to get back here. And now we got Steven got hold of Ting here in the ring. We got eight-man tag match right here. We do. I'm sure I missed some incredible action because all four of these teams are fantastic in their own way. Super dynamic mix of tag teams, but so creeped out about even sitting in this chair after getting going was here, man. And here we go. Now TJ Apex has got a hold of member black and yellow here. Apex part of CXR. Remember we got, ooh, shot right there. Double team move. Shell Connors assisting TJ Apex. You're looking at former tag team champions right here. Now CXR. The, the titles are not on the line in this match, but I feel like if black and yellow loses, they should be forced to wear black and yellow Argyle in their next match. I think that's only fair. Cover here. Hook to the leg. Shell Connors. He's got almost one in for his team there. And remember, we got Even Stevens and CXR take on Black and Yellow into Infinity Beyond, who's inserted in this match at the very last minute. What a nice surprise. You know, there's nothing I like more to excite wrestling than surprises. It keeps you on your toes. I mean, like John said, we're going to rip up the format at this point. We are, but that's kind of the fun of Speedy Fest. You never know who's going to be coming in and out. You never know what's going to be going on. You see the hot air balloon being blown up in the back here. I think it'll be a, a beautiful backdrop for our pro wrestling, but Jail Connors kind of laying in some punishment here. And a shot there by Ting to Shell Connors, part of CXR. What a roundhouse kick there by Ting. And now down goes Shell Connors. That's right, he's looking for a tag here. His birthday boy partner, Theodore Javier Epix. It's probably for the best that this Ted of the Ride that they're about to put up right next to our spot didn't happen before this match was booked or TJ being the dumbass that he is probably would have jumped out of the hot balloon onto somebody. Probably, I mean, that sounds like TJ Epic's always taking risks. And look at Corey. Dumbass or a daredevil because he's got a little bit of both in him, I would say. And Corey Jackson's fired up right now, took his shirt right off, and now he's going for the Bulldog. To TJ Apex, Shell Connor is trying to get back to his feet. Absolutely. Took his shirt off. Not his best. That's the other side of this. They'll be leaving now, their best. Now, Shell Connors, he's, he's, one, he made a mistake by putting on the vest because it is so hot. He has another match to go. He does, but we saw him wrestle three times yesterday, Moose. Yeah, but that was a little bit different. There was uh, some rain. It wasn't as hot. It wasn't as humid. He wasn't wrestling four guys at once. 
Yeah, but he was emotionally charged. He was trying to get back to HC Loke for sure. And look at two Fendi beyond. They got Steven and they got the other Steven. My God, Stereo Stevens. And here we go in the ring. Ooh, counter there. Taking it to Steven and all that German suplex. Steven over there in the corner to Infinity and Beyond showing out as they always do. Two of the most incredible wrestlers that we have here. Here comes Colin Delaney. Stunner into a German suplex. What a combination by two Infinity Beyond. This is why a lot of people enjoy watching two Infinity Beyond. But now feeding to Corey Jackson. Look at this teamwork being done, John. This this camera shot of this awesome match, a hot air balloon about to encompass the ring. What I don't elbow. know what's going on today. I think that's what it's all about. We got this incredible backdrop for this incredible match. There's and a lot super kick on. by CXR. Sorry to interrupt you and cut you off. It's okay. The chaos continues in the ring as well. There's nonstop action here. And look at this CXR going in for a double team maneuver here. But wait, counter by Cheech. He saw it. He, his instincts kicked in, and Colin Delaney goes in for another stunner. Look at Shell Connors. The extremely cute wrestler, Colin Delaney. Big boot by Steven. Earning a smooch from Effie a couple months ago, earning his way into this match last minute. Kick by Corey Jackson, and now Steven's got a hold of him, plants him with the DDT, and I now... I'm just hoping that they've got control of this hot air balloon. Never mind that referee Frank Sasato has control of the ring. And look at TJ launching himself, talking about air balloons right now. And now Cheech takes down TJ Apex. And now Shell Connors, ooh, takes an inverted atomic drop. And now they're going to set him up for something. Colin Delaney and Cheech signaling for the end here, maybe. Double team maneuver coming in. And now Apex gets the tag. Double team move by two Infinity and Beyond. And wait, Epix with a roll up. Two, three, and wait, he's got the tights too. He stole it for his team. 